This is what it's like traveling to New York after more than a year of no travel. I've always had a soft spot for New York City. A few months into dating, Anthony and I went there as our first couples trip, and it was an unmitigated disaster. We fought through much of the trip, and when we finally got home, we broke up shortly after. So every time I go back, I feel like I'm erasing the memories from that one bad trip and replacing them with good ones. One memory, though, I hope I never erase. We were seated at this table at a place called Isadora's while he was eating a bagel sandwich, and I said to him, I don't think I have the strength to be the woman you want. And evidently, he believed me because he broke up with me a few days later. Why would I want to remember that? Because I want to be reminded of how absolutely wrong I was, how badly I underestimated myself. I fly back to New York to revel in the sound of my footsteps, consume the green air of Central Park, and push back against the thrum of Manhattan to prove once more that I am as strong a woman as I need to be. Not for him, but for me.